Welcome back, guys. I'm back with another video. So, tap in, guys. If you are new to the channel, welcome. I am the Empress. Happy to have you here with me today, guys. If you are returning, welcome back, guys. Thank you all for your love and your support. All right, so we're going to go ahead and jump right on into it. Let's see what message we get. We got don't stop unlikely unlikely and be assertive okay we got within the next few weeks something may not be the right time at the moment it could have something to do with the connection, a romantic partner. Something may be unlikely right now, but within the next few weeks. But right now, I'm getting like it's not a good time for something. Something is unlikely. All right, so let's go ahead and talk and let's see what's, what's going on. Let's see. What is going on? What is going on? What's unlikely? Okay, a situation. Okay, maybe there was an argument. I feel like there was an argument, a disagreement between you and somebody. And it has to fizzle out. Like, someone is still upset. Somebody is still upset. This person could still be upset. Yeah, they're over it. They're tired of the drama. Okay, so somebody is over the drama. Okay, this could be you or this could be someone that you're dealing with. And I feel like maybe there was a disagreement and it has to sizzle out. Like somebody isn't ready to um, make amends just yet. I feel like someone is upset currently. It could be you, somebody upset with you, or you upset with someone. But it's, it's, it's not the right time to make up. Okay, it's not the right time. Like this person is not ready to make up right now. They're not. <laughs> but somebody's still in their feelings. Somebody still is in their feelings. They haven't gotten over it yet. I feel like in the next few weeks, this person will reach out to you. But right now, this person is upset. Yeah, we got the lovers right here. At the bottom of the deck and the nine of cups. And the King of Swords. This person is could be a Libra, Gemini, or Aquarius, or a Pisces, Cancer, Scorpio, or they could um, have a water, a water moon sign. So this person could really like when it comes to their emotions, they take their emotions really serious. Um, but yeah, they they're giving King of Swords energy, so they're pretty serious about this Libra, Gemini, Aquarius energy. Yeah, that's what I'm getting. I'm getting like somebody is, they're not in the space right now to forgive. They aren't ready. Yeah. They feel overwhelmed. They feel overwhelmed. We got the Ten of Wands. They feel overwhelmed. <laughs> they got a lot going on. And just like at this moment in time, this person is just like, their focus isn't on, um, their focus isn't on reconciling right now. Yep, we got the Magician and the Queen of Swords. I feel like you, you gave them the business. You, you spoke your truth. And I feel like this made this person feel some type of way. You made this person feel some type of way because you spoke your truth. So if they're mad at the truth, then oh well, let it be. It is what it is, right? But there, I feel like you two are mirroring each other's energy right now. So I feel like you gave them the business. Well, your words, I feel like your words, it has something to do with your words, what you said, what you spoke to them. 
it, it, it touched them, okay? They, they feel some type of way. They feel some type of way, yeah. They're in their feelings. <laughs> we got the moon, okay? So, definitely giving water, energy, Pisces, or Cancer. But this person, they definitely in their emotions. The moon is about your feelings, your emotions, how you feel. And I feel like this person, they feel like a final decision has already been made to... to um, you two to end this connection. So yeah, they're sticking to it. I'm hearing standing on business. <laughs> yeah, we got the seven of pentacles. So they're kind of waiting it out. They're waiting it out. And they're taking their time. Okay, they may have another person in their energy. A fire sign could be. Um, or they're waiting for someone else to come around. They're waiting to try to replace you. They're going to try to replace you. Yep. They're waiting on another offer to come in. And I feel like once this offer comes in, that's when this person is going to come back around. So they're waiting it out. They're waiting for you to regret acting so tough. Okay, so they feel like you're trying to act tough. They say they're going to replace you, and then they're going to try to come back around. This person is focused on getting their lit back. I'm telling you right now, this person is focused on getting their lit back. Okay, so within the next few weeks, let's see what's going on. How are they going to come towards you within the next few weeks? Because right now, this person, they're watching you. We got the observer. They're watching you. I feel like this person is going to be trying to come in and try to teach you a lesson. They are going to reach out to you. <laughs> we got communication. They're going to try to reach out. I told you. Didn't I tell you? This, this card jumped, jumped on the floor. They're mirroring your energy. So whatever you said to them, this person is going to try to make you stand on it. And um, they're mirroring your energy. And I could definitely tell with that King of Swords and that Queen of Swords. Both of those are very, I said what I said, type of energy. Okay, so I feel like you spoke it, you, you gave them the business. And then they like, oh, yeah, okay. We'll see about that. We got recognition. I feel like the vibe is going to be kind of off between you two when this person come back around. Like the energy or the, energy, the vibe is already off. And that's why you spoke your piece. Yeah, third party. Somebody's giving a vibe of third party. Okay, so somebody, you could have been giving off a vibe that there could have been someone else in the picture or they're going to be coming back around trying to um, add you to a third party. Be careful with this person because this person, they're fixated on getting their lid back. Okay, so this person's focus is, I'm going to get my lid back. So be careful when dealing with this person. Oh, something wanted to jump. Let's see. admires this person admires you they look up to you but yeah understand them yep there they go i'm telling you this person is gonna come back around they're gonna be trying to stir a pot okay they're gonna be trying to stir the pot they're not coming around with good intentions not this time they're not coming around with good intentions at all they're gonna try to play the victim Okay, and they're gonna they're trying to wait. They're healing right now. They're trying to get over um, what you two went through. But this person is definitely coming back around to start a pot, and then they're gonna try to play victim. Okay, yep. Mm -hmm. They're gonna try to start a pot and come around and play victim. Let's see. How does this person feel? See, right now they don't want to talk because they haven't replaced you. They haven't found somebody to replace you. Chemistry. 
I feel like you two got to have a good bond. But I feel like you put yourself first. I feel like this time around, you put yourself first. This person feels the type of way about it. Keep an open mind. I tell you, they're going to be calling you. They're going to be reaching out. But the only reason that they're going to be reaching out is to get you in bed, okay? They're going to be flirting around with you to get you in bed. And when they get you where they want you, they're going to drop a whammy on you. They're going to drop a whammy on you. They're, they're planning and plotting. I'm telling you right now, they are planning and plotting. How does this person feel? Tell me about how this person feels. <laughs> hit the gym muscular looking good great body hard work physical attractive so this person is very physically attracted to you they feel like you have a nice body so they're very like sexually and physically attracted to you this is more like a physical attraction yep love bombing manipulation hidden intentions shower with attention influence someone's behavior i told you this person gonna come around they gonna come around flirt get you where they feel like they want you and then they're going to try to drop a bomb on you. Because they're going to try to replace you. Follow her. Your influence is, is invisible. Too focused on others. Supporter, admirer, believer. This person, they could be secretly following you on social media. And I told you, they're trying to figure out how to finesse you. They're trying to figure out how to trick you, how to get you in your feelings, how to get you, knock you off of your game. I feel like the way that you, the way that you present yourself is very badass, very savage, very confident. I feel like this person is intimidated by your confidence and the fact that you slay, okay, that you on point, you dominate your competition, okay? You good at whatever it is that you're doing, how you move. You could be very strategic how you move. No, you just ain't taking no BS off of this person. This person don't like that because you're too confident. You're too cocky. You're too, they feel like you, you're arrogant. So they're going to be trying to figure out a way to butter you up. Look at what this says. Getting something in a slick way. Smoothing things out. Still buttering up. Persuade, persuading and charm. They're going to figure out a way to charm their way back in. But the intentions... I don't feel like there are good intentions, okay? I don't feel like it. I don't feel like the intentions are good. Let's get a, let's get a few more. Is this, a, is this person's intentions? What are their intentions? Are their intentions good? Are they going to be reaching back out? And what are their intentions? I thought I saw something more to jump. Let's see. Within the next few weeks, didn't that come out already? Okay, within the next few weeks, they trying to, they trying to uh, find somebody else to replace you. You're ready. And spirit is saying, be assertive. That means stand on business. Okay, when it comes to this person, because I'm telling you, I already see it. They are full of BS. If you believe, watch what you watch what you fall for when it comes to this person, because they're coming in within the next few weeks, and their intentions are not the best. They aren't. They aren't. I want to see exactly what their intentions are. They're investigating you. They're watching. <laughs> they're watching. You. They're definitely sitting back watching. You. Observing and arguments keep showing up, so y'all could have gotten y'all got in an argument or disagreement. You spoke your truth. Yeah, they're very attracted to you. Like it's something about your body. Maybe you work out, you in the gym. Show me good intentions. Show good intentions. Recording, revealing. Really. Be careful, this person might be trying to record you and keep you a secret. 
They're checking stuff off of their list. They got a whole list. They got a whole checklist of intentions. I'm telling you, don't trust this person. Don't trust them. That's what I got, you guys. Y'all let me know what's going on in that comment section below. Be sure to subscribe, guys, so you won't miss out on future videos. And liking the video and sharing the video and commenting is a beautiful way to energetically um, help this channel grow. And I'm um, thank you all so much for y'all love and support. And until next time, ciao.